I'm gonna show you how to easily speed up or slow down your videos in Premiere Pro. Here inside Premiere Pro, I already have some footage down here on the timeline. So in order to speed up this clip, all I'm gonna do is right click on it, then go up here to speed and duration. And if I want to increase the speed of this clip, I just need to increase this number. So if I want to double the speed of this clip, I'm just gonna change this to 200% and then press okay. And that's gonna speed up the clip. Now, if I want a video to be in slow motion, I'll typically just shoot that at a higher frame rate and then I'll drop that down in post. And if you have no clue about what I'm talking about, I'll leave a video right up here if you wanna check that out. But I have found myself in certain situations where I shot my video like normal at a normal frame rate and I actually decided that I want to slow down the clip. So in order to do that, you can either select a certain portion that you want to add slow motion to or you can do the whole clip. So I'm just gonna go and find a spot that I want to add slow motion to. We'll go right, right there and then cut that clip there and then find the spot where you want the slow motion to end and then add another cut. And then I'm just gonna move this extra portion over here out of the way. And then I'm gonna right click on that area that I wanna add slow motion to and go back up to speed and duration. And in order to slow down the clip, you're just gonna decrease this number. So I'm gonna decrease it by 75%. So I'm just gonna change this to 25%. And then this is really important. You gotta make sure under time interpolation that you change this to optical flow because Premiere is going to create artificial frames and optical flow is just gonna make sure that that flows smoothly. Then just press okay. Then I'm just gonna bring the other part of this clip back over and you're gonna have to render this out in order to make sure it doesn't play back choppy. But once you select all of that and render it out, it should play back smooth. Now, I don't know about you, but when it comes to percentages, it gets super confusing for me. So in order to do this very easily, what you can also do is press R on the keyboard and that's gonna bring up the rate stretch tool. And you can go to the end of that slow motion or sped up clip and stretch it out if you wanna make it slower or shrink it down if you wanna make it faster. It's really just a personal preference, but if you're gonna be slowing down your clip this way, you still need to right click on the clip and then go up to speed and duration and make sure that time interpolation is changed to optical flow and press okay. Then you can just bring that clip back together and then render this out. Now I didn't touch on speed ramping in this video, but if you'd like to learn more about how to do that, check out this video right here. And if you're looking to improve your video editing skills, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss anything. I'll see you in the next video.